So I just want to give you a little example because the past couple weeks I've been through hell and it's been lining up for me my entire life, just the direction that it's gone, that I've been hunted from day one because of what I'm doing now, waking up, shining light for people. I was always misguided. And the problem is you don't realize that you're misguided until you're backed into a corner. People think that angels are this light, fluffy energy. I've never felt more powerful than an angel. An angel has such a high voltage energy. It's, it's, it makes you come alive and you never want to work with anything else. An angel is so high voltage that it silences the air around it. When Archangel Gabriel was with me, is with me, but after I went to that house, the entire everywhere I went was whited out. I got home and this place was screaming white energy from the floor to the ceiling. I needed to keep my throat chakra open to keep accessing him in that manner. We say words and we say, we have these intentions, but you don't understand the power that those words hold. You don't feel the full force of it until you start waking up. Because I can tell you, when you start waking up and you start working with something dark, you distinctly can feel. Just by having them come into my presence, it's not what it feels like when you're not fully ascended or awake. It seems alluring when you're asleep. When you're awake, you realize that they're these pests that It's just so, it's so evil. It's, it's low voltage, it's evil. They hunt you, they haunt you. They just kill the kill. And then they keep it moving. This all goes, it all went like it did for a reason. And, um, I'll go more into detail about the things that have panned out but I've never felt more whole and guided and I look back and I realize how misguided I was and how many people today are misguided how many people today are possessed like how many people today think that they're living their lives the way they want to and they're not steering something followed me through lifetimes to try to stop me from doing this for you. And it almost succeeded, but evil will never prevail.